SAIC is here at Martin Day Marine. We're showing off the AAV survivability upgrade program and our offering for ACV 1.1. We are the principal integrator for the survivability upgrade program. This vehicle has been in the fleet for 30, 40 years and we're making fundamental upgrades to this program to make it more survivable while at the same time recovering land and water mobility. It's important for me to be here today to see the Marines look at the vehicle experience what we've done to it and see the reaction and get feedback from the actual the Marines who are going to be operating the vehicle in the fleet. This vehicle right here, the AVSU, what we've done to the survivability upgrade on this thing is to make it harder, make it more safe, blast mitigation seats, new deck plates, new armor, just make it more durable so it takes a hit. And, and when it does take a hit, the Marines it can actually walk away alive. The Marines are testing these vehicles. We have now built 10 of them, and we will be prepared to, once testing is finished, go into a low rate production starting next summer. Being a former Marine and a former Amtrak, they're talking with the Marines today. They're glad to see the vehicles being upgraded, and it's good to see a survivability upgrade to keep the Marines alive in battle. As the program manager for ACV, it's important for us to be here because it gives us the opportunity for customers to touch our vehicle, for us to explain face-to-face -face, uh, what we're offering to the Marine Corps to meet requirements. So it's a very mature technology. So we think we're fully qualified to meet the Marine Corps requirements and be selected as their ACV provider. It's important for us to be a modern day Marine so we can interact with our customers. We get a chance to meet in formal settings. This gives us an opportunity to have the Marines get in the vehicles, have informal discussions about what we're doing, how we're doing that, reestablish and, and further establish our partnership with them. It's been a great relationship. The new SEIC is represented extremely well here. You see on one side you have Boeing, on the other side you have BAE. And then here's SEIC with two massive vehicles in between the two of them. I think that's probably the best example I know of of showing how SEIC has evolved in our new operating model of competing with these OEMs for major vehicle contracts. We're doing extremely well. We couldn't do this program without our partners. One of the key aspects that I think differentiates us from some of our competitors is that we have integration of the supply chain throughout the entire operation. Here at Quantico, where you get direct access to the general officers, they're able to walk through this complex and see our hardware, our vehicle, the benefits of our integration hands-on. One of our fundamental values is mission alignment. So this program is perfectly aligned to the Marine Corps' requirements. It's incredibly important to us. We're just very, very, very proud to have the opportunity to support that mission. It's an honor to us. They've seen it, they like it, they've touched it now, they've been in the driver's station, they've seen the changes we've made. So a lot of excitement of what we can do together to deliver more mission capability to the Marines.